Hello again, everybody. Ralph W. Yoker, Go Hills TV, powered by Winger Company. It's time for our post-match interview with Coach Lindsey Michelle. It was an exciting night. It was a fun night, very electric night in the Hellier Center. But at the end of the day, uh, it didn't come out uh, the way we wanted. Uh, Coach Lindsey Michelle joins us now. Coach, uh, you know, it looked to me like in that first set, 25-22, we were hanging around. But it kind of looked to me like we had some girls that were just a little timid to cut loose and really let it fly. Uh, in that first set and, and took us a little bit a little bit to kind of maybe get some of the jitters out mm -hmm. and really let it fly. And, you know, and we talked a lot about that or a little bit about that, I guess, at the coaches show about how you overhype this, you underhype this. And, you know, I think with the gym full the way it was and you know, it was awesome in here. But, um, you know, I think we had a little bit of the jitters and, you know, they they came on hot. And I think, you know, watching their game film and stuff like that, they definitely put on a showing more than they have this last weekend and, and Monday night. So um, they definitely came out a little bit more physical than we did. You know, we got after it there in the second set, and uh, that was great volleyball on both sides. Uh, how did we – what were we down? We were uh, down at least eight, maybe ten. Holy buckets. Uh, I'm not going to lie, I had all but written us off in that set too. And <sighs> the girls come back and get the win, and – it's an amazing win. That was a whole lot of fun, but that takes a lot of energy. Yeah. And I felt like we did cut it loose finally in that. Uh, but then in the third set, after you expend that much energy, you have to get out fast, and we just didn't. Yep. Um, that's, that was what, exactly what we said in the timeout. You come out there, and you play ahead, and you play in the lead, and you don't look back. And, yeah. You know, it, the hole wasn't as big as we dug in the second set, and so I kind of thought, okay, well, we're – we're getting ready. We're gonna we're gonna do this, and you know, just uh, play from behind for too long, and couldn't get it to. You know, we just didn't get physical, and our hitting percentages went down. Uh, we, you know, got up there, and we didn't make bad choices on the tips. But when you're against a team like that, you just you've got to have the attitude. You want to crush the ball and find the the seams. Their block, you know. Uh, it was a little bit more open even or closed. Their block was a lot bigger tonight than I'd been, uh, you know, the splits I've seen as we've been kind of taking notes on them this last couple of weeks. And, um, you know, they, they wanted that. They knew they had to work hard for that because Lala did a pretty good job of moving the ball around, um, you know, for most of the second and third set. So. She obviously was playing through some pain. We could see that from here. I what a gutsy a, performance. She got a Charlie horse, I think. Um, and she came down weird, and I thought it was an ankle, and then it looked like she was stretching her calf, um, you know, but that's, I was in a situation where, what you going to do, girl, because it, it was hard to make a change at that position. Mello can set for us, but uh, Lala was in the front row, and, you know, she can come in and Mello's position, obviously, uh, but, uh, yeah, it wasn't a good time for that. <laughs> Well, Coach, uh, obviously it didn't go the way we wanted tonight, but there's not going to be any time to uh, set and pout because you're going to get on the road uh, tomorrow, and they better show up ready to go because you're going to come through a pretty tough stretch here uh, where you're going to have to play some good volleyball. Yeah, I, here on out, I mean, everybody, all, the Division twos that come in here or we go see, and then, yeah, a lot of tough Division ones, and that's what we need, and that's what we want, and, you know, we just know we got to show up better, get Jenna healthy, and keep Lala out there playing well. And, uh, you know, it's the easy <laughs> things, though. It's the easy things. It's the attitude and right. the effort. And it's when I ask you to get fired up, and th those are easy switches. It's not like you got to go out there and pass the ball. You got to give me some energy and, you know, change your face to that excitement that you know you can. And, you know, we just talked a lot more about that in the, in the locker room than really anything else. So, well, one thing about it, we did win 11 in a row before tonight yeah. you've got a tremendous volleyball team the, another thing that we talked about last night this is not a season make one way or another right. we want to win it but uh whether we win it or they win it there's a lot of volleyball left to play there's sure another is. date with them on the 20th of october yep. and there's a and there's a national championship that both teams aspire to accomplish so uh, certainly this is just uh, a night where we didn't win and if mm -hmm. you play enough against enough good teams you're not going to win every time out but this is a group of girls that did win 11 in a row coming into this. Yep. You did go out there without Jenna Lee for the first time. Yep. So that does affect your chemistry. So all in all, uh, you know, there, there's some things you can take away from this. And we'll find out 
what they do with it here in the next few days when you, yep. when you yep. play we down sure in Tyler, Texas. I hope they learn Texas, from so. something from tonight. So, yep. No doubt. Well, Coach, uh, great to talk to you, and it was a lot of fun in here tonight. Can't sure wait to, to get back to hell you're here. It's going to be a little while before you come back home and we see you again, but we wish you the best of luck out there Thank on you. the road uh, with these girls. We'll be keeping an eye out on you. Thank you, Russ. <laughs> All right. Uh, this is Go Hills TV. We're powered by Winger Companies, and we're going to call it tonight. Thanks for watching, everybody.